Good afternoon, Hilltop families. I hope that everyone has had a great week. Despite the short week, this has been another wonderful, impactful week here at Hilltop. First, can you guys believe that a week from today, graduation will be behind us? I I'm still just in shock that this school year has come and gone so quickly. What, what an amazing first year for me. I'm, I'm just so thankful to everyone for such a great year. Two quick reminders. Next Thursday, June 7th at 10 a.m., that is our low, lower school graduation. Friday, June 8th, 10 a.m., that is our upper school graduation. Very excited to see our graduates, their families, alumni coming to campus um, and celebrating these wonderful students. This has been another great week. Let me jump right in. So yesterday and today, we had some visitors from Korea checking out Hilltop. So yesterday, we had three Korean students. Today, we had 16 Korean students along with five of their teachers. And it was wonderful watching our students engage, learning about their cultures, what's the same, what's different. I loved it. In conjunction with that, yesterday we had the Berlitz World Language Skills Demonstration. I was blown away at the skills, at the language acquisition that I saw from our students. Watching the improvement from back in September until yesterday was amazing. Listening to the Spanish, the French, and the Mandarin that was spoken, I was, I was in awe. Well done, students. I'm very excited to share the news and success of our second Introduce a Girl to Engineering workshop. This was a community event. We had 20 Hilltop girls and six girls from the local communities um, join us. They were ages four through 12. They uh, spent the afternoon tinkering, engineering, designing new um, activities they um we really just wanted them to have a lot of fun and i think that happened uh some of the uh, projects that they worked on uh, building a hydraulic lift they used a piece of wood to make a pencil holder they had to use a drill for that project we had recycled bottles and zippers for them to create a carrying case uh, there was 3d printing uh, they also had a drawing project that they used um, an LED sticker, uh, copper tape, made a simple circuit, and then they were able to light up their drawing. Uh, one of the best things about a day like this is, you know, Thursday morning, seeing the girls come in with um, their new supply cases. Uh, I even saw some fourth grade girls put their wooden block pencil holder on their desk. Uh, you know, just so full of accomplishment and pleasure in the work they completed. And I think something like that is just awesome. Our upper school math students, they had an interesting week. Check out this video. These kids combined a little bit of math and a little bit of movement. <laughs> Finally, today, our upper schoolers, they were able to enjoy the pentathlon, which is a hilltop annual tradition in the spring, one of the many great traditions we have to wrap up the school year. I wish everyone a wonderful weekend. I am actually headed up to Maine for my college reunion and to celebrate one of my kids' birthdays. I look forward to seeing everyone on Monday, and have a great weekend, everyone. Bye now.